I thought I'd better come back and do a cleanup haul. A dog doing something. I didn't get it all cleaned up and I'm fixing to leave. I'm fixing to go to Pat's. Uh, if y'all watch any of my videos, you'll know Pat by storage buildings and I didn't get with her for a long, long time, you know, with everything that was going around and we hooked back up and she called me the other day and I talked to her a couple of times over the weekend and uh, today, no rain. Maybe 50 degrees, 55, Pat. I think it said sun. <laughs> so I thought, wow, well, I'm halfway decent. And I used the makeup out of the last haul. We'll talk more about that. I like it. So I thought I'd better go ahead and finish up this haul. Three more at the garden stakes. They're just too cute. If these would make cute uh, to make in like gardening gift baskets like Omi's birthday's in May and say she was into gardening. She gets stuff anyway. <laughs> into gardening. I could take some of these stakes. Here's a ah, frogs. Ribbit, ribbit. Four frogs. Four more bunnies and four mushrooms. And they're just called uh, craft wood animal picks. I actually got them to go out in the yard and use to uh, mark my plants with. If you want to get adventurous, you could paint them or you could let your kids paint them. Who knows when uh, the kids come back and I've not used these yet. I can get them to paint. Wouldn't that be cute? So I got three more of those for a dollar and a quarter a piece. I seen this and I had to get it. Chalkboard ornaments. What am I gonna use it for? I have no clue. But it was little birds. Chalkboard ornaments. That not cute. And on the back side, it actually is plain. You could actually paint you up a bird if you wanted to, if you were adventurous. I do good to get out of bed, get my shower took, get dressed, get my animals fed, get my husband fed, get Eli fed. But if you get adventurous, you could paint the back side. I got one of those, and it comes with a burlap to hang them up with. Of course, I'm, I don't know how I'm going to use these yet, <laughs> when, or if they'll go in a gift basket with, maybe with some of these and this, and yeah, so that's that. What else did I get that, oh, I bought two of these the other day, and I've showed both of them. I think I'm gonna put one in both of my pantries. I've got a room in there, got this outdoor deck in that we uh, boxed in. And I really, especially in the wintertime, kinda need to know what the temp is because I don't keep heat out here at all. I do keep heat in there. Metal, th metal thermometer garden collection. And this one has little flowers on it. Not roses. But they're cute. I was hoping they'd come out with some with my animals. But I haven't seen those yet. Maybe they will sometime. But for a dollar and a quarter and it's metal, you can't beat that. And it's pretty. So I got that. Eli got some of these in his stocking over Christmas. <laughs> he can't find them. Did Mama put them up? Did Eli put them up? I don't know. It was supposed to go in his backpack. But them poor kids, they got to carry their backpack all day at school. They're not allowed to use their lockers ever since the lockdown. Doesn't make sense to me because it's, I, I know it's, one less thing to clean and to uh, sanitize and all that. But then poor kids, and I think I'll talk to the, I think I'm going to talk to the principal. 
see how he, hang on just a second, okay? Hang on just a second. See Don't if this works. quite know when you'll see this video, but they're out of school today. Today's Monday the 12th. I've already got one for tonight. You might see it. No, today's the 13th. Tomorrow's Valentine's Day. I doubt you'll see it on Valentine's Day because I think I have a, another one I want to show you. So you might see it after that. This is his backpack. He has to carry it all day. It weighs at least. I should have weighed it. I'm going to go weigh it. That's how my brain works. It weighed 15 pounds. I thought more like 25. <laughs> He's got to carry that thing all day long to school. So I think I ought to talk to the principal. That's not good for these kids back and stuff. He's in the sixth grade, and I know they're probably a lot stronger than I am, but I had bought him some of these little disposable shoe covers. So when it rains, he didn't want to get his shoes wet walking from the bus to Boy and Girls Club, which is a few feet away. They have chaperones that walk with them, but he said, I need some boots, and I said, how about some shoe covers instead? Because I knew he wouldn't wear the boots. Don't have room in his backpack to carry him around in. So, I bought him another pack. I know we'll come across the ones he got. But since they had them, I got them. Anything else for outside? It, Lexi's actually eating some of these. I've gotten kind of strict with her because she has a lot of itching. I think she has an allergy. She gets out there and gets in the cat food. So she's been eating some of this, which is Purina Beneful, antioxidant rich, six ounces, a dollar and a quarter, not the best price, but when you're just trying stuff out or you're in a pinch or you're on the road and your pet needs something, it's not a bad deal to get those. Let's go back to the self care for a minute. I've been sh showed you some of the makeup I've been using, and I've got some others that I'll show you later, but these are just too cute. You could use them in a gift basket for Valentine's Day, which will be after by the time you see this, or makeup removal pads that are in hearts. To me, be honest, a good wash rag and cleaner, it's really all you need, but I have been using these, especially since I show them. I mean, if it were to the fact that I couldn't get them anymore, I'd be all right, but they work extra good. I've got some in other shapes, like circles. I wish they'd make them a little bigger, though. I do. They're so little, and they have a thing that you can hang them up with, and it is a Greenbrier product. That's about all it tells you, makeup removal pads. Feminine cleansing cloths for sensitive skin. Citrus tangerine scented, sure and fresh. Especially when you're traveling, camping out. Just need a quick pick-me-up refresher. And I'm all about, it's almost spring. I like to get some of these lighter scents. Ah, like the orange. Citrus tangerine. So I'm anxious to smell that. I don't want to open them right now because I'm not quite ready for them. I have some of the modest uh, bath stuff that you can get. I think it's 18 pack now. Open, so I don't want to open these, but I've got those. Deep Like Me Almay Smart Shade Skin Matching Concealer. Says it's a new look. I'll have to try that. Re blend to reveal color. Medium to full coverage. Helps conceal minor imperfections for face. Almay's carried at Walmart, I know, and I'm sure other places. I just got one of those. I didn't even use concealer again today. I didn't in the last video, all because of the makeup that I'm using. And I got Be Pure Medium 
Since it said medium, I thought, well, that's pretty good. Benefits of an eye cream and concealer all in one. Hydrating. Got hydraulic. Yeah, hydraulic acid. So I'm anxious to try that. And I'll I'll have to let you know how it works when I do. I just didn't do it today. I kind of tried to hurry because I know I'm leaving out. I bought these last year. Yeah. Warm all winter long. I may have to actually... I could actually wear either one of these today with my dresses. My dress and sandals. But it's the Juncture Men 6 to 12 in the green. I've actually got green sandals that this blends with. Got it in the red. And it's not solid. It has the black running through it. Gentle, thermal. It says boot socks, and they do go great in my uh, slogger boots and all that, or my tractor supply boots, but I'll wear them with these longer dresses. See, I can put the sandal on. <laughs> this, I, this one's a little bit too light. The green would be more like it today, but I have, red, I have sandals that match these too. Can you tell I'm serious about my sandals? I actually bought some out of the plus section back during the summer and warm pretty much all summer when I went off and I loved them. Five dollars. Um, got Eli another t-shirt. No, I didn't get that at the Dollar Tree. I can't show you this yet. Or did it come from the Dollar Tree? got a tag on it. I don't think that came from I'll show you where this came from. This will I'll show it to you. I thought it came from the Dollar Tree and it could have come out of the plus section and had the tag on it. I'll have to look when I go back. But I got them that. I can't think of where else I would have got that at. It's a Nickelode Nickelodeon. I don't know. Just know the Dollar Plus section. This is how I work. <laughs> Has all kinds of t-shirts. And Eli likes most of them. I got them that somewhere. But where did I get it at? Did I get it at the Dollar Tree? But I thought that was cute. It was up here with my Dollar Tree stuff. Could it have came from Walmart? Maybe. I think the Dollar Tree. We'll see. Can't show you this right now. Because it's actually on that phone that... You know, the Dollar Tree has cell phone cases. This one fits a phone XR, which is what I'm recording on right now, the iPhone XR, and I got it in blue for a dollar and a quarter. It just helps me grip the phone better. If you don't have a backing on these phones, they're so slick, they fall out of my hands. He and he picked up one day when we were there some window cleaner. Yeah. It's been in here for I don't know how long. 64 ounces, glass and surface. Awesome. Window cleaner. We've got all kinds of spray bottles here, and he bought that. So I got to give that to him because it's been sitting down here for a while. Found one of my wish list items. Can you believe it? I did. Heather was with me. Not sure if one of them's going to work exactly the way I want it to, but that's all right. I've got an idea. Got the fabric with all the little cows on it and the piggies and the chickens. Fat quarters. Can you see it? Looks like a horse. Homestead organic. Has all kinds of little words on it. Love this fabric. Love this fabric. And I got some of this one. I really like this one for the fact that uh, you can actually see the animals and you can see the cannon jar and the feed pail and the, the pot that you cook in and fish and pigs and yeah. I bought several of these too. The only thing is when 
I looked at it in the store with Heather. I was hoping that it would go this way with the design. But the design actually goes this way. But that's all right. Because Angie likes the fabric. Is that not pretty? Anything else that I have sitting here that you've not seen? Be thankful. Bought these more recently. Reminds me of Thanksgiving, but I like them because it's the buffalo check. I put these on the porch a lot of times and the cats lay on them. Or I'll put it on my uh, little antique love seat in my living room on the seat because my cats lay on them. <laughs> and it keeps the cat hair off the couch and onto this. Or you can use it at your front door, your back door. For a dollar and a quarter, you can't beat it. I promised you I'd show you, or I didn't promise, I told you I would, which me, I try to remember. Some of the makeup I used yesterday. I'll show you everything that I used newer yesterday or from the Dollar Tree. I'll show you what I didn't. I didn't use all of it today because I was in a hurry and I was just using what I normally do. My new favorite makeup, Ardell. Photo face. Angie's going to be looking for this. That's what I put on today. My most favorite makeup of all time, other than Cover Girl, that's a, you know, compact. And if I come across it, I'll show you. It's kind of a liquidy, but it turns like to powder when you put it on your face. Is the Bye Bye Foundation Full Coverage. Full Coverage Moisturizer Oil Free. This is my last one. I used to be on an auto ship from QVC to get these items. And I auto ship ended. I didn't renew anything. I saved these for when I go out. Of course, this right here is comparable. A lot more money for this. But I really like the Bye Bye Foundation. That it. My most favorite foundation next to my cover girl. Everybody likes stuff different. What works for one may not work for the other. But this is my new favorite from the Dollar Tree. I'll be on the hunt for it. Maybe even today. Yesterday, I'm not really into glitter. I was mainly interested in the center one. I used that center shadow yesterday. You can see it on my little applicator. I use that one, and it is by LA Colors. I used a different, and I used it again today. Uh, it's either purple or pink that I showed you last time, too, of them, purple or pink containers. This one's the Wowie Lash Curve LA Colors. It's got the curved brush. I like this mascara too. And for a dollar and a quarter, you can't beat it. One thing about paying a dollar and a quarter for items, you can try more items if you can afford to. And if you can't afford but just a little bit, you can find decent makeup at the Dollar Tree. I used the dark one of this one. And it may be I'll use the shimmer too. I just liked it. Wet and Wild color con and it looks like a teal underneath but yesterday I just used the brown you get eyebrow pencils this one's a Tony at the Dollar Tree this one is supposed to be clear it's called uh, B Beauty Essentials it was clear but when you do your eyebrows, you take this and go over it and kind of mold them into place. This one is wonky. I've had to have some stuff done to it in the past and my eyebrows grow crooked. So I like to use like a mascara. It's clear normally. This just picks up the color because of uh, after I... But just a mascara brush. Do I use it every day? No. But I like to when I'm going off. Yesterday, I used this blush 
It's a little bit lighter than I normally use, but I like it. Ah. See, it's a tricolor blush, and I just put my brush in it, and and it's by LA Colors. LA Colors, I use quite a bit of LA Colors, and then there's a makeup called Believe. I don't know if the Dollar Tree's ever had it. I get it at the Dollar General store. Uh, I like that brand. But that's some of the makeup Angie's been using lately. Needy, oh, 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 I forgot something. I gotta show you this so I can put it up. It's good till 5, 17, 23, not say probably longer. It's the Mango Margarita Mix made with all natural ingredients, real fruit and pulp will settle, which that's why I did that because I could see that it was settling. I bought this for recipes. Yeah, you can use it in mixed drinks, but you don't have to. You can put it in spritzer water, ice water. You could put it in tea to kind of flavor tea. Uh, or you can use it in recipes, because I found some recipes, and Eli loves mango. There's nothing in here that he can't have. Got cane sugar, lime, lime juice concentrate, mango puree, Puree concentrate, blue agave nectar. What is blue agave? I don't know what that is. Nectar, key lime juice, concentrate natural flavors, salt, beta carotene, absorbic acid. I don't see any chemicals in this at all. So we're going to try it for a dollar and a quarter. No, he can't drink it or I can't drink it straight up. But we're going to try that in some different stuff and see how it works because Eli is really into mangoes right now. So, may have to do, I've got a pie I could do it in. We'll see. Depends on when Angie gets around to it. But I got a warning for you. I love my jars. But when I washed my jars, I noticed one of the lids. I told you they had seals in them. One of my lids... See how it does right there. And I'm sure uh, I could probably warm it up. Or maybe just when I put it back on. But make sure your little seals in there are completely attached. Because this one can pull it apart a little bit. But I brought another jar out. I told you I love these jars. They're wide mouth. I should have brought it. But I have this beautiful pasta here. I don't know where I got it at. I think it was with Omi at probably, oh, TJ Maxx. <laughs> I don't have to ask Omi. Pay $3.99 for it unless it, when I sell it, say compared to $6. Cooking time, 10 to 12 minutes. Good till 10, 10 to 23. And I've had it for a long time. But I'm gonna show you why I like these jars. So pretty. So I went and got this out. Who would my who wouldn't love to see this kind of stuff sitting on your counter or on your shelf? Try to make sure I don't dust it. I was gonna see how much of this one pound something of cold. I've been determined it's over a 40 ounce jar. Ah, don't want to drop them all. Ah. Well, I lost a couple. The chickens can have those. How's that? The chickens will eat these. It only held maybe half the bag, so I may have to put the rest of them in one of my other containers. Hang on. That, I thought, well, I'll put part of them in these clear containers. It'll remind me I have this pasta. Put my lid on. I'll change the lid out a little bit. And again, it might seal perfect. Let me see here. I'm trying to make, yeah, it's going to seal down. Look how pretty that is. Is that pretty? Now I've got my beans, I got my pasta, got 
Got more to go. Y'all just help me do a little bit more. Hang on one second. Well, I only dropped turn. one in the floor. That's not too bad. I'll have to break it up. But I love these containers too that come from the Dollar Tree. I could have put the whole bag in here. It may wind up doing that. I don't know. I just like to look in the jar. Or I could have used one of the smaller ones had I had them emptied out. But I love these containers from the Dollar Tree. They're lightweight. And when my arthritis is acting up, I like the fact they have a grip. They close up really easy. I keep getting these oatmeal sugar and all that in these. Yeah. So Angie needs to do some organization. I don't know when, but I'm going to. But right now, I got to get off of here. Pat's waiting on me. Dollar Tree's waiting on me. Anything else waiting on me? Waiting on my daughter. Yeah. She called me right before this video, so I'm hoping maybe she can meet up with me too. Her husband's been under the weather, and she not really wanted to leave him. I don't blame him. I blame her. Eli was under the weather over the weekend. He's a lot better now. Of course, he didn't have to go to school today. He's even better. So, y'all help me get it all done. All my Dollar Tree stuff I've showed you. Unless I haven't. Could find something else. May have another haul for you later on. I've got a couple of more wish list things just like I did these and I found them. So, until next time, I hope y'all have a great day and we'll talk. <music>